The operation was apparently named after the television show, The Office, that is set in a fictional paper company with the name Dunder Mifflin and located in Scranton. In a press release Monday, United States Marshal Martin J. Payne announced the results of the operation. Between August 2 and September 17, the U.S. Marshals Service, USMS, coordinated with the Scranton Police Department, supported by the Pennsylvania State Police, PSP, Megan's Law Section, to verify the registered home addresses of 219 registered sex offenders living in and around Scranton. Thirteen of these offenders were found to be in violation of sex offender registration laws. Nine were arrested and four are sought for the eight of those arrested were men and one was a woman. The persons were previously convicted of crimes ranging from indecent assault, sexual abuse of children, statutory rape, corruption of minors, sexual abuse, and involuntary deviate sexual intercourse. Payne said, the Adam Walsh Child Protection and Safety Act of 2006 designated the USMS as the federal agency responsible for helping local and state authorities locate and arrest convicted sex offenders who fail to comply with their Megan's Law requirements. It's a mission that receives top priority and constant attention within our agency, he continued. Scranton Chief of Police Leonard A. Namiotka added, this joint operation was successful in ensuring those required to register remain compliant and those who are in violation are brought before the court to answer for their non-compliance. The cooperation between the Scranton Police Department and our law enforcement partners is paramount in making our community safe for all citizens, he noted. Those with information about the four being sought for violations or other fugitives were asked to contact the U.S. Marshals at 1-800-336-0102 or usms.wanted at usdoj.gov.